dogs. There are loyal companions, obedient, eager to learn, very trainable, and so affectionate. For years, humans have been studying how to best train this very intelligent animal. I'm a professional pet minder, so we look after animals、uh, when people are away on holidays, and a dog trainer. Yvette has come from Darwin, Australia, along with people from countries all over the globe, to the Couch and Valley to perfect her dog training expertise. But what she's learning here is a bit surprising. All the way to Canada was the excitement of being able to train a chicken. That's right, Yvette is learning to train chickens, and the instructor is a renowned dog trainer who teaches people to work with animals by first training fowl. We're using chickens as models. To、uh, enhance our dog training skills, chickens are faster than the average dog. We don't have any preconceived ideas on how to train a chicken. As far as the people attending the the workshop, they haven't done it before, so they can come in with an open mind. For those who don't believe you can train a chicken, well, here's proof. Targeting a little round disc, so they peck the disc、um, and rewarded for that behaviour.、Uh, and birds actually, or the chicken, can actually see colours and patterns, so we can move and change the discs around,、uh, and they will discriminate between each and every、uh, target that we put down and teach them to go to. Basically, they're going to the one that we've taught them. They will be rewarded for. The training involves using a clicker that they associate with a reward, food. Here, the chicken sees that if she pecks. The red disc, she'll get the reward. One of the factors that we use is that of positive reinforcement. If a behavior is followed by something the animal enjoys, the behavior will strengthen. So we set up the exercises so that the animal wants to do it, and then we mark that behavior. That's what the click is about, and reinforce the animal, reward the animal with something like a. In the case of the chicken, a piece of corn. But food is not necessarily the only motivator. That's why the training can transfer to teaching behavior in other animals, even humans, and especially athletes. They don't just do it for the food. It ends up being a process of understanding and enjoying the game as well. Each student is assigned their own birds they work with for the entire week. I have got two chickens. One that's come along a lot quicker than the other. And、uh, so, big girl, who's just over there, she's doing very well. So, after the week-long training session, students will go home to their dogs and leave their chickens behind. Personally, I I, I love a cuddle of a chicken. <laughs> In the Couch and Valley, I'm Terry Church.